Um, so today, uh, what Precipice is going to do is um, create an hour or more long play based out of two suggestions from the audience, two non-geographical locations. So not um, San Francisco and Mexico, but something more like, um, uh, what did we have yesterday? I can't even remember. <laughs> we had a clown yeah. and college. A clown college and a zoo yeah, yesterday. And a, and a, and a an igloo and a tent and things like that. So if I can have from the audience uh, a location that we can represent. 7-Eleven. A 7-Eleven. And now I want a location that has nothing to do with a 7-Eleven. A hospital. A hospital. Well, <laughs> <laughs> so we, we, we bring you the, uh, uh, the play of 7-Eleven and the hospital. So many different brands of drinks, it's unbelievable. The cheaper ones are down here. Well, they put the more expensive ones at eye level. So why are you looking at the bottom right there? Are things not going well, Rick? Right? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if you can't shell out the three dollars for your vitamin water, I, I can do it for you. Vitamin water? I can just drink tap water. No, but that's vitamins. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but, but but if you use an old vitamin water thing and you put tap water in it, people still think you're drinking vitamin water, but you saved two eighty nine. It's okay. It's gonna be okay, Rick. Okay, there is none of that here. Now just buy something or leave. <laughs> you know, this is a little human compassion here, all right? We're, we're not just consumers. We're not just not here to feed the capitalist machine. I see this all the time. I am tired of seeing it. Just buy the damn water. Uh, this is a public place. Damn. You're embarrassing me. It's just, here, you can grab No, me. no, you, don't be embarrassed. You have to have, you have to be strong for yourself. You have to stick up for yourself in the world. That's why things aren't going wrong for you. You're not a fuck up, man. You're right. You should that's be more assertive. That's exactly right. Buy me two vitamin waters, bitch. There you go. There you go. That's what I'm talking about. And I'm going to take the Kit Kat also. You know, um, there's a line where aggressive crosses over to... Oh, God, I'm so yeah, sorry. I'm I am so you. sorry. <laughs> this was so sorry. Yeah, I'm going to get you the one vitamin water. That's great. That's wonderful. Thank you, buddy. You know, we got to quit later. I, I don't know if things have been going well for you. <laughs> Don't say her name. No, 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 you have to say her name. Say her name. Jessica! <laughs> get it out, get it out, all those feelings inside you, Rick. Just let them out. I'm actually uncomfortable when you do that. <laughs> I know that human connection has always been difficult for you. That's what she said. It's like you've been talking to her. Yeah. She says I'm a robot. She says I don't show enough emotion. Well, look, that's emotion, right? That's emotion. Right? That's emotion. If you want to cry, I can be with you. I can make you cry. I'm good at that. <laughs> you should see almost all my exes. They're always crying. <laughs> Why don't we get the big cat We take you now to uh, one of those incidents where uh, Dan's ex was with his ex and she was crying. So, um, yeah. I, I took your, your, your mom out on the boat yesterday. That's, a, that's something. Yeah, Why? yeah, I want to show her a good time, you know. Oh, did she have a nice time? Well, she fell off. <laughs> she, 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 said she didn't make it. <laughs> Flash forward to another time that Dan made his uh, ex cry. You're actually, to tell you the truth, the only girl I've ever been with who hasn't been able to give me an orgasm. <laughs> Fast forward to the third time Dan made the next cry. I mean, uh, if 
thought you understood what I was. I'm not gay. Yeah, but I am. <laughs> Class four. Cholesterol level and lead to an early death, but that's okay. <laughs> what do I have to look for? Okay, here. The next day at Dan's work. Sorry, I'm late. Yes. Ten minutes. I uh. Oh, look here. That's the third third time this week you're late. Dan, is everything okay at home? No, no everything, everything's fine. I, I think that your, you know, your obsession with punctuality is really undermining the entire organization. <laughs> you know, eight o'clock is eight o'clock. Not eight o three, not eight o five, not eight ten, eight twelve. It's, it's, it's a pattern. It's getting worse and worse and worse and. Worse. I'm a creative person. Uh, I can't be tied to those these rigid schedules. Okay. Well, I need flexibility, I need air, I need room to breathe. Well, you don't get that here at work. If well, you don't let me breathe, I'll suffocate. Well. That's almost the definition of suffocation, <laughs> is not being able to breathe. Okay, well, right now I can't breathe, so I'm just gonna step back here and, uh, fine, breathe. Boss, uh, yeah. I was, uh, I'm supposed to be here at 8, as you yeah. know, and hey, I was sitting uh, at 8.01. I need punishment. No, I'm going to punish you, oh, all right? God. All right? 8.01, that means you're late. Oh, you are late. Oh, yes, you're late. Oh, oh God, God, I love it. Oh, God. Punish, punish me. I'll see you in the break room. Okay. I was 8.01, and I didn't care. No. I'm gonna take care of you later. <laughs> <laughs> wow, is, is that in the benefit pack? So there are consequences. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not. It's just a thing you know, Bob and I are having. Well, you know, I. I, I... You didn't see that, because. But don't worry, I also control HR, so. <laughs> you control HR? I do. Oh, no, I do. Don't want to mess around with HR. No, nobody you know. wants to mess around with HR. Yeah, so um. Especially when I'm in control of it. So anyway, um, I uh, I need to get going. Okay, so. Uh, well, I have, you just uh, got, you just got here. The reports are due. All right, fine. I'll go. I'll go. I'll go work on your reports. They're, they're due at two. Today. Three hours later, while working on his reports. <coughs> What's the rush there, big guy? The rush is that if I if I don't get these done by two, I have to be, take part in some sort of sadomasochistic ritual. <laughs> <laughs> That's what seems to be driving this organization. They play with your mind. I'll finish it for you. You'll finish the report? Yeah, why not? Okay, I just have to, you know, uh, tally up some of these uh, uh, these figures and come up with sums that are indicative of some sort of trend that no one's really going to pay attention to anyway. Yeah. That's sort of the nature of these reports. I just sometimes put it in the inverse columns. Nobody ever notices. Nobody ever notices? Oh, no. I mean, these go over next I guess I'm done with my report. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, Jim, uh, I have something I need to ask you about in my personal life. I just, uh, oh, yeah, go ahead. I've noticed, I've noticed a trend, you know, this recurring trend of, of, of causing pain to people unintentionally. I'm beginning to think maybe that there's some sort of black cloud that rides above me, some sort of, you know, I'm some sort of evil talisman or something. 
I mean, I have good intentions, but they always seem to go awry. This is where I pipe in with some advice. Yeah, that's what I was hoping for. You're a great guy, man. Just be yourself. Just be myself? Be yourself. Oh, that's great. I will. <laughs> oh, by the way, I banged into your car in the parking lot. Sorry about that. <laughs> I just made the final payment. <laughs> yeah, well, it's just a car. <laughs> That night at uh, Sheila, the boss's house. minutes later. And that deserves spankings. No, oh, God. Yes, it does. Oh. Uh, okay, okay. Okay, we can't do this all the time. No, I mean, we gotta be serious. <laughs> yeah, we sometime. do. Mom, what, what is this guy doing here? Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm just... sorry? I thought we were through with this, Mom. Oh, well, honey, sir, Ma, uh, you're not supposed to know about this. This is kind of a routine of hers. I, I wouldn't have guessed. <laughs> I'm working on it. What's your name, sir? Bob. Oh, good Bob. God. Bob. She hasn't mentioned me? No, she hasn't, Bob. She hasn't mentioned any of them. I just see them here. Them? Them. On occasions. They're always here at 801, 802. <laughs> 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 Tell your mom that I was late. <laughs> no, sure. Mom, someone's late. Again. What? Well, I was on. Do you want to go in the other room? Well, uh, no, maybe he should leave. Oh. Look, let me look, look, hey, hey, if, if this is a bad time, he can leave. You were late. Hey, okay. I was late before her. Oh, whoa, 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 is that your daughter? Yeah, that's uh, weird. Yeah, yeah. Hey, do you want to like get a beer or something? I, I mean, it's like, uh, I don't think this is happening for either at this point. Uh, There's a bar down the street. Most of them gathered there at around 8.20. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we've been making it there by 8.22. <laughs> <laughs> Honey, you don't supposed to see all of this or Mom, know about this. you're doing it in the living room. I mean, where am I supposed to go? I, uh, I've been working on my issues. Listen, it, it's good to be punctual. It is. Yeah. I don't and know what. It, and it does, it does upset me, you know, and I, I take my regressions out and stuff on, especially the male population when they're late. Hey, you Mom, know. I set all the clocks ahead like you asked. <laughs> Thank you, honey. So, they're early. Huh? Oh, geez. Oh, wow. That's a lot of punishment, and everybody was on time, though. Wait, yes. go. <laughs> Yeah, I was watching from the other room. Oh. <laughs> That's what we should work on. Getting him a blind he can't put up. And the lock on the door, maybe. You know, kids, I I'm going to stop this, OK? Especially around the house. Why, why, why Mom? I mean, he, I mean, we've been watching you for, 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 for years. I mean, you know, oh, it's, growing it's, up. I know, but you know, under the textbook conditions of good parenthood, that's that's not good you're parenthood. Good, you're a good you're mom. great mom. I, I'm a good parent. I'm a good mom. Yeah, because you're always late. I'm always on time. And I taught you guys very much to be punctual. Yeah, yeah it's great. And, and, and I'm like, you know, head guy at school, knowing that nobody messes with me. All the guys want to talk to me at school because I see you do it here. I kind of know what to say now. Yeah, but you don't, you don't want to say. <laughs> I don't want to say all of those things to the 
Not all, all of them, but for... Oh, oh like, I act all the odd. Oh, we make a great team. Yeah. I, I, I find the boys, I take the money, and I send them to her. <laughs> <laughs> Later that week at Rick's house, his one bedroom studio apartment, TV dinner. Bing. Hey Rick, it's me. Let me in, buddy. Oh, yeah, come on in. The key's underneath the little garden toad right next to the doormat. Really? thing you're doing with the girl. Okay. I'm, I'm Just in. come on in. Sorry, I would have given you a spare job. Why? Just a picture. It's huge. I mean, it's life size. <laughs> Rick, I mean, this has got to stop. You, you can't do it. I mean, uh, here's your key. I don't know. So if you could put it on back the toad. I'll hold on to it for, for now. All right. Uh, Hey, I could put in another Swanson's Hungry Man for you if you want. Wow, that'd be great. All right, excellent. I, I'd sit down, but I, I just, it's creepy. I, you know, it's really just like... What, you don't have pictures of loved ones at all? It's three-dimensional, for God's sake! <laughs> I mean, you gotta get over this. I got over this whole thing with my boss. I'm not gonna be late anymore. How's that? Hey, excuse me, the door was open. I'm the animatronics man here to, anim uh, uh, to animate your picture. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> so much. programming, I, I, I think your choice of programs was exceptional. Yeah. Right, yeah. It's gonna be just like her, except for maybe more sympathetic towards me. Oh, yes, remote control. This has gotta stop. SFW. I mean, you're, you're going crazy. Don't infringe on my business. This is my life. This is how I make my living. Look, I really dislike what you're doing to Rick, but uh, here's my card. Do you make dollars? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I'm Because I, I'm yeah, I, boss. I, I, I could tell the minute I came in. That's all right. <laughs> Here you go. Oh, yeah. It's pork. Oh, boy. This all is right. like, I love the mashed potatoes, too. You know, it just, Hold that's, on a that's second. the best part with the instructions manual. Uh, I actually put a dollop of real butter on the mashed potatoes. And why aren't the peas so ever better. hot the same way the mashed potatoes are? Okay. I don't know. I've got to boot this up. Okay, I don't, well, this is uh, really, really, I, I don't think this is a good idea, Rick. No, no, it's just good as peas. No, that's not what I'm talking okay, about. It's hold a good on a idea second. for Swanson. It's not a good idea to be doing... Setting three. I mean, if you're going to have... Hi, Rick. <laughs> Hello, Jessica. I don't know that you had to yell. I just... Oh, God. Huh. Ow, 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 ow. Do my biometric... <laughs> Do you want to do anything this evening? Yes, Rick, I would love to hang out. <laughs> nice. I, I gotta admit, that's, that's very lifelike. <laughs> it has a generation, sort of. This is my oh, friend, Bob. Hi. I, I, I <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Bob. Hi. Would uh, you like to hang out tonight? Okay, uh, the three of us, or uh, the, just both? Uh, 
What would you like, Rick? <laughs> you never asked me what I wanted to do. <laughs> this is great. I, I, I think this is a problem, though. Again, Rick, you're, you're imposing yes. somebody's personality. Let's all three hang out. Maybe we can watch Forged and Fire. Jessica hated Forged and Fire. <laughs> I love that movie. Yeah, yeah, you know, Rick, maybe this is telling you that Jessica wasn't the right person for you, you know? <laughs> Jessica, turn on TV, channel 43. <laughs> uh, I love this part. I, you know, I, I saw this last week because I streamed the whole damn thing after I, my boss said no more. Okay. <laughs> this I'm, show is amazing. <laughs> Now, did she really like the show, or did she just program to say she likes the show? What does it matter? <laughs> it matters. The real Jessica didn't like it, but this Jessica does. Back at Sheila's house, her children are conferring over their business. <laughs> I think if we roll some of the, all of these funds into a Vanguard index, we'll do better in the long run. Great idea. <laughs> Should we, um, should we add any more, like, benefits to the packages? Like, I don't know. I don't know. I think we need to really up our game. Yeah, we do. I don't know. I, you know, it's great being in business with you. I know, it's so you know, great. You know, I know I can trust you because we're, we're siblings. We're a team. We, we're, we're, we're always going to be a team. That's right, forever. It's me and you forever. Right. So when I go to college, you know, you can come with me, even though you're still going to be not in college, but you can come with me anyway. I don't think we need to go to college. <laughs> not, not with this business. I mean, how much do we make this year? Uh, we're, we're, we're closing in on 20,000. Oh! Yeah, yeah, kids, you know, kids have a lot of disposable income these days. Kids will spend money on anything they can't get at home. But I have to tell you, to be honest, I'm starting to have second thoughts about what we're doing. Why? I don't know, it just seems kind of weird to, like... You feel like you're pimping me out, you could say it. Yeah, I feel like I'm pimping you out. I mean, yeah. I know it's like, you know, totally PG. PG. But still, it's like, I you know... I give him a tap. Yeah, it just, Sometimes you know... Sometimes a little leg tap. These things escalate, you know? I don't want things to escalate. They don't escalate. No. But I love the money. It's really a moral... I don't know what to do. Maybe we should change it up and... Find another way to make money. You know, I'm worried about mom. You know, she really seems to be compelled to do this. It's not about money for her. Mom's lonely. Yeah. That's what it is. We need to find her somebody. We need to find her somebody. We need to find her somebody who, who, who's punctual. Punctual. Organized. <laughs> and, 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 and organized. Nice. Somebody who doesn't push her buttons, you know? Doesn't get her all riled up. Right, somebody keeps her nice and calm so she doesn't lash out and hurt people. Yeah. You know? I think they like that, though, so I think... Why do you think that is? Why do you think people like to be hurt? I don't like to be hurt. I think we're... I think we're... I think we're looking at it at the wrong angle. You know, mom's passionate. Uh, that's true. I don't really have passion in my life. Well, we're so young, I mean... I mean, the last time I was passionate about anything, it was Hot Wheels. Yeah. <laughs> I like the Barbies. Yeah. Collectibles. Yeah. I like to put the Barbies across the Hot Wheels track and I run them over. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'd go take your Hot Wheels and I'd flush them down the toilet yeah, and mom would like, be mad. Yeah, she'd have to clean it out. Yeah. It didn't really work. No. no. <laughs> right. Then you cut my Barbie's hair and then so we stopped doing that. Right. And then I got the G.I. Joe's. You got more Barbies. There's so many Barbies. Barbies. Right, right. But I got the life-size Barbies, you know? Uh, right, which is really funny next to my little G.I. Joe's. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a circus thing. Yeah. Flashback to little G.I. Joe and Big Barbie. Hi, Barbie. I'm back from the war. Hi. I'm going to step on you now because I'm so big. <laughs> Flash forward. We're much more creative with our business yeah, now. Yeah, well, we only had one shot with the G.I. Joe's and we yeah. couldn't try anything else. Yeah, smashed it. Yeah. All right, well, all right, let's keep it up. I... Let's, um... No, I can't do it. Okay. I can't do it. Okay. I know we're making all this money, and I know, I know you want all the money, but I'm, I'm, I, I have to put an end to it. Okay. Yeah, okay, you can put an end to it. I might keep going myself. 
Um, <laughs> really? Hire one of the big kids to, to keep it going. You know, I'm twenty thousand dollars in three months. Yeah. We just started this thing like. That's true. I know. It's like it's it's, it's such a temptation. You know. As the siblings continue to discuss whether they should confront their mother or not, at that same time, Rick was at home in his one studio apartment. You've already seen this episode I really of Downton Abbey. I don't Abbey. like this episode. I don't want to watch this anymore. <laughs> I'm tired of looking at those microwave meals you make. Can't you make a whole meal every once in a while? But you don't even eat. I mean, what does it matter I what I eat? I can see it. I can see it every day. The same meal over and over and over and over and over again. Okay. The same show. Okay. Over again. Well, what would you rather do? You sit than... down. You stop yeah, around. Sorry. So much. <laughs> sorry. Just you know. change the remote to channel 43. Oh, God. Not again. Favorite. What is the show called again? Oh my gosh, it's called Real Housewives of yeah. Alaska. <laughs> <laughs> At 4 p.m., Real Housewives of Potomac is going to be on. Can you record that one? Yeah, maybe. Can I just maybe go to the bed and you can just. I like hearing your voice. Well, that's almost nice. <laughs> Okay. But not that voice, the one where you're talking and sweet. Yeah, yeah that one. okay. That one. Thank you, Jessica. Change your channel again. Yes, ma'am. Oh, not that one. Sorry. Not that sorry. one. Sorry. That's good. Oh, sorry, Rick. I, I used the toad and let myself I in. I told you not to give your friends the key. Sorry. Uh, uh, what the heck is going on <laughs> here? Uh, Bob told me about this, but I didn't believe uh, it. It worked out really well at the beginning. Uh, Jessica, this is my friend Dan. I'm not a circus show, Dan. <laughs> <laughs> She's worse than the real one. <laughs> <laughs> Don't say that in front of her. She'll take it out on me. No, no, you, 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 you shouldn't be afraid of it. Vice, can't you read Please be quiet. Yeah, okay, it's hold on a second. part of the show. They're arguing again. Sorry. What's just happening? Did you just worse than it back at the 7-Eleven? Let me click it off. Okay, click it off. Why are you subjecting yourself to this? I don't know. I mean, no. in a way, it reminds me of the real Jessica. <laughs> well, you know, these... This artificial intelligence is very, uh, very smart these days. It picks up on your patterns and reinforces them. It's like fate. There's no way of getting around it. Anyway, maybe I should call Jessica back. I, I just, if I, if you call her back, I would get rid of the doll first. It's, it's not a doll. It's a three-dimensional hologram with a little bit of artificial intelligence in it. I think it's like Sharky. <laughs> <laughs> that's what it is. I think in the middle of the night it's going to get up and do something to you. The next day at Sheila, uh, at work with Sheila and Bob. Eight o'clock. Right on time. Yeah. Thank you for, thank you. Yeah, that's what I do. I, 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 I didn't have to come late all those times. I'm, I, I enjoyed it too. I mean, I really enjoyed it when he came late, and you know, and um, but <clears throat> there's certain things like my my children. I'm, I'm worried about them. There, there's so I I didn't even know you had children. So well, worried about her two children. Yeah, because you know they, they emulate me and they 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 see what I do and then they try to do those things and uh, those things. I mean, that's, that's... Well, a... not like that, but, you, you know, they, they pick up bad habits, and I just want a normal relationship. And since we've known each other for a while, I thought, thought maybe we could have a normal relationship. You know, I... Would you want to come to dinner? Really? I, I want a normal relationship. You do? Yeah, because this has been oh my fun. God. I mean, really a lot of fun. I mean, so much fun. Did I well, say we can, well, we can still have fun, Yeah. but we can have like consistent, normal relationship, and then we'll have a little fun in once in a while. All right, HR, please. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're 
I'm just... Wait a minute. Uh... <laughs> Wait, I, HR uh, police? I yeah, that, I control the HR. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that's what they always think. Oh, that's God! When I, I look at my job description and the uh, hierarchy of everything, it says that I control the HR. You control the HR. The HR police control the HR. Oh, oh, I didn't see that loophole. HR, you, oh. us. Nobody controls HR. <laughs> it's like an entity of its own. Wait a minute, I... So, you guys were talking about a personal relationship here at work that you've been having. Oh, yeah, uh, well, we, well, we were at work. On the clock! On the clock? I mean, what else do we have? I mean, there's just the clock just, in us, which just... A couple, minutes, out. a couple minutes after the clock, but yes. From 8 o'clock to 5.30, you belong to the corporation. And we've had complaints oh, that some people have been taking advantage of their authority over their underlings. Well, I didn't but complain. You can be sure of that. HR sees everything. <laughs> Nobody is allowed to torture employees except HR. <laughs> We're going to have to ask you to go see the uh, board at uh, Thursday afternoon at Thursday. 4 p.m. Okay. And don't be late. <laughs> no, I'll be there at 4. Thursday at 4. Okay. Does this mean everything? <laughs> <laughs> This is, uh, I better get back to work. I mean, uh, yeah, they're I watching. Did. I didn't know they were watching. I, I, uh, I we're did. always watching. I got that. <laughs> God, I, I, wow. Uh, does this mean? I'm kind of worried about my fate. You know, like, like I said, everything has consequences. I can't imagine. Look, uh, you seem to be in a bad way right now. Uh, I am. Does this mean we can't have dinner? I don't know. We can have dinner, we just can't discuss dinner right now. <laughs> Got it. Okay, we'll come up with some sort of code. Uh, code, uh, well that's interesting because that's what uh, I'm like, doing here, I'm coding. <laughs> <laughs> this is the irony of everything. Yeah, I love irony. Yeah. Am I allowed to say that? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, I was so free before. We were so free. We were free. free. <laughs> and now everyone's looking at everything I say. I don't even know. Does this mean that I, I'm, I'm mentally ill when I, when I talk? Bob, I'll your strokes per minute on your keyboard have gone underneath the required code. I didn't know there was a oh stroke motor. <laughs> this is not what I signed up for. Actually, if you read the agreement, it was. <laughs> Uh, In my project, please, then. Please show the agreement. Oh my god. That is what you signed. Oh, wow, I signed up for a lot more than that. I, they can call me at any time. I, do you know my phone is bugged? I didn't know that. Oh my god, is my phone really bugged? Yes, it says oh too, that all your bosses will be bugged too. Let me look at my agreement more. This is crazy. They this... can even see us outside uh, through our window at our house? What kind of agreement did I sign? Later that night at Applebee's. I do feel a lot of stress off my shoulders. Yeah, I mean, I think returning that uh, animatronic Jessica was really the way to go. Yeah. I mean, it was... Uh, and I'll tell you, I think it's really worked out well, because once I turned her off, I've got it over her. Uh, yes. Yeah, no, it's yeah, great. Like, well, Applebee's, I mean, this is like really something special. Like, if she was here right now, I would go in and tell her, you know what? You have control over my life, but no more! Oh, oh God. It's like... You know, we gotta go see the tractor pull after this. Oh, okay. oh, hey, Jessica. Hi, Rick. Hi. Good to see you. Good to see you. This is 
with my new boyfriend. Hey. Tommy. Hey. Hey, Tommy. Hey. Yeah, yeah. Wow, he's old. <laughs> we, we dated for two years. Yeah. Two years. Yeah. Two years of misery. Yeah, that's what I heard. Yeah. Okay, that's a little mean. She's mean in a good way. He yeah. likes how authoritative I am. Oh, yeah. When I say Applebee's, we go to Applebee's. I love Applebee's. <laughs> I think. I've never been here before. You're going to love it. Well, 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 well Rick's something been, been really working on himself. And yeah. he's, he's really been improving and getting stronger and, and more, more assertive. I, I, yeah. He amazes me every day. Right. Yeah. So, yeah, you guys. He even got rid of the animatronic, Jessica. <laughs> you made an animatronic out of me? <laughs> oh, 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 that's so weird. That's weird. That's oh, weird. Oh, God. That is, um, let's, um. I got a picture, but it's like two dimensional. Right <laughs> you have a picture of me already? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, you know, whatever you want, I do. Whatever I want, he does. Uh, yeah. That's going to get really old really quick, no, it's, Tommy. It's, 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 don't listen to him, okay? Don't listen. Okay. Hey, Tommy, do you like action movies? Because you don't starting now. <laughs> They're horrible. <laughs> Mission Impossible, piece of shit. Tommy, if, <laughs> Tommy, if you have a pet, you're probably going to build it up for adoption soon. Allergic to a lot of hairs. <laughs> also, you'll be shaving your back. I don't like man hair. And you're going to have to use, start using the bathroom on a schedule, I'm told. I need my time, and no one else can use that or order it with any other order. You know, I'm glad you're out of my life. Can I have permission? Well, I'm glad you're out of mine. What would you like, sweetie? I'd like to leave. No, we can't leave it. <laughs> Man, it'd be nice, because, like, I, I think this isn't going well. Jessica, it's, it's going I, great, Tommy. I like my dog. We'll just put him in another place. I'll go visit him. I can't go put him in another place. He's been with me Jessica, the whole time. If anything else, I've but got not... a few of your keto cookbooks that you made me cook meals out of from. Not Fuji. They'll be in a box Fuji by the front guy. door. You can pick them up. I'll grab them tomorrow night. Please do. Let's go somewhere else, Tommy. Applebee's is a piece of shit anyway. She, <laughs> she, Sheila and Bob sneakily meeting up at the coffee shop. With, with no real between you and your husband. Well, I guess not. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, we loved each other. We just. I mean, usually something happens where, I don't know, a, a flashback to that happens. And <laughs> now it, it's like I, I, I don't have that power anymore. <laughs> you know, sometimes as we you go really, through our lives. You really got to remember hard. I, okay, you know, that's yeah. good because I don't want to even know what happened. Well, I'll tell you what happened. Okay. <laughs> you know, we were young. It was 
I was 18. Oh, oh my God, I he was, was handsome. No, I, I was handsome. Yeah. <laughs> I probably shouldn't go on about how. Well, so I'm not really handsome. I mean, no, you are really handsome. Oh, that's really nice to hear. But but I was a young lady and yeah. we were uh, we were going out and uh, he drove a Monte Carlo 1967. It was like a super muscle car. And I love the men in muscle cars and uh, and it really uh, turned me on. And, and we went to prom. We went to prom, boy. <laughs> Maybe well, you became to grow up first or something. No, it became, it became my husband when we had sex in the back seat of the Monte Carlo. Okay, this part I don't know. And then a few months later, well, you know, the children came. And Both they, of them at the same time. <laughs> the one. It was first our son. Yeah, and then, and then, uh, then we had uh, we stuck it out. You know, we were together for eight years. Oh. It was nice, and it never worked, but it was nice. <laughs> <laughs> and then we fizzled out, you know, like a lot of couples do, and, and then I just moved on. Into some strange yes. punishment reward thing. Yeah. I mean, it seems a little B.F. Skinnerish of you, for those <laughs> who may be inclined to know that. But I went there, you know, and I, I, I lived that life, and I'm done with that life now. Yeah, and so am I. I mean, don't get me wrong, I, I like We can still have some of that. Yeah. <laughs> but I, I still so. want a normal relationship. Me too. With one person. Thank you for choosing Chippy's Coffee. Free refills as long as you stay. And you guys have been staying for a while. Oh, we probably should, right. should get back to it. Oh my God, we gotta get to work. Oh Jesus. <laughs> Holy jeez. Okay, I'm, gonna, go I'm gonna go this together. way. I'm gonna, go, I'm gonna sneak out this I'm way. I'm gonna go this way. Meanwhile, between third and fourth period at the local elementary school. Elementary <laughs> school. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I had to get that out. Okay. Thanks for doing this one last time. Last time, I promise. It's gotten a lot easier since everyone got Venmo. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Rachel. Here's your homework. I'm sorry it's late by a period. You're late by a period. I am. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. I'm going to Venmo the money to you. Okay. Wait, wait. Um, I might have been two periods late. I can pay. Go. These answers aren't even right. Oh, no. Go get Marcus. He knows all the answers. Come on. Okay. It's an extra $2 every minute you're late. Thank you. <laughs> wow, you really take after mom. Yeah, I see her get all raging. That thing was just a thing. It's just a bad. Just... I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it. Yeah, I don't know if that's the way relationships are supposed to be. I mean, not when you watch them on TV, right? No. I mean, the moms and the dads, like the, the Brady Bunch, yeah, they all like a together. Happy family. Yeah, and, and there's even a step family, and they're happy. Yeah, but we just have different dads come in and out. I don't know if it's the same. Yeah. I think maybe you have issues. <laughs> maybe I have some. Yeah. I mean, that's what, you know, I don't know. But, uh. But you're really good at it. It's kind of scary. You know, yeah. I've been watching this thing on TV, <clears throat> Dr. Oz, and sometimes he has other people come in and talk uh -huh. about their problems. It's usually health related, but every once in a while they have, like, family issues. Um, and I realize that I think I do have some. That's right. No, I've been watching. I've been watching TV too. But Dr. Phil. And we don't do real cable. RuPaul's Drag Race. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I have the whole season. Oh wow. Yeah. Cool things about that show. Yeah, it's uh, you know. I, sometimes I just don't feel like I fit into the world, you know. So you watch RuPaul. I watch RuPaul. And Dr. Know. Phil. And, 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 and Dr. Phil. And, and you ever watch the, the, the Mari show? I don't know about that. Oh, they fight a lot. Oh, 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 Mori, oh, Mori, oh, Mori, 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 Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. No, 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 yeah. That's right. Look, um, I'm gonna close up the business for my end. I mean, if you want to recruit people, you recruit no, I people, think, okay? I, I, mean, I think that's it. I think you're smart to do that. I think this is our. Uh, 
the last time. As a matter of fact, I've done all these homeworks. I think I'm last year. gonna. I'm gonna move downstairs into the den. I, no, no, don't move downstairs. No, I'm beginning to think that both you and mom are just a bad influence on me. Like mother, like daughter, but yeah, I'm like gonna mother, try. like daughter, you know, and, and, and it's just, and I, it's just really doing bad for my self esteem. All these guys come over and get beat up, and they beat up these boys for the I know, I know. You only could turn in one assignment. Speaking of which, that very afternoon at the hospital. Hi, Mommy. Did the doctor oh. call you? Where's Daddy? Uh, Daddy's on his way, honey. Oh. I, I have a, a bruised spleen, the doctor says. Yeah. Hello, it's good to see you. I'm Dr. Myers. <laughs> Thank you, doctor. I haven't Thank done anything yet. I know, I'm Look. taking you in advance. <laughs> I don't know, there's been a sudden rash of injuries among the, uh, the, uh, the primary school-age children. It's almost like an <laughs> epidemic. That's terrible. Oh, we've got, we've, and, it's, and it seems to be gender-related. It's only boys. <laughs> only oh, late hey, boys. Uh, I got you, uh, I don't know, some sort of uh, tinker toy or whatever. Here you go. Thanks, Pops. Yeah, you got... You know Myers? What the hell are you doing here? I thought you were disbarred or whatever they call it in medicine. No, 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 no. You can't. You can't. You can't. Bar? No, it's, I've, I've, I've been granted an extension until I die. <laughs> That's a long extension. Actually, not so much. <laughs> the good thing is just this kid, because if it was my other kid, I wouldn't let you near him. Oh, come on, pops. What's wrong with you? I'm a doctor. I was trained. I was trained in the Cayman Islands. <laughs> That's hardly a place. I got all my money there, and I know they don't have good doctors. Oh, you're some sort of xenophobic, huh? You think only the United States has trained doctors. Ow! Oh, oh shut up, oh. man! Stop it! Oh, you're I'm so bored! Stop it, oh, God! Oh, honey, you're in so much pain. Can you do something about the pain? Yeah, I think I'll sedate his father. That's what I think. <laughs> <laughs> you can't do that. Oh, God. Oh. Yeah, once we started sedating family members, things go much more smooth. Well, you can't do that! You're illegal! I'm going to get my lawyer! <laughs> I'll tell you, I wish I thought of that years ago. Don't worry, they'll be fine. They didn't even want to know how I got hurt. I thought they would have asked. Well, it doesn't matter how you ever you got hurt. It's, uh, you know, it's, it's unusual. Oh. Ow. So how did you get hurt? You know, honey, it's been a long time since I looked at clouds. <laughs> I was late. They're pretty. You were late? Yeah. I was late. Oh. It cost me four dollars, but I was late. Oh, I like that big white puffy cloud okay. over there. It looks like a big charm. Okay, here we go. I, I think you're waking up. It does. All right. Yeah. Are you going to behave? Huh? Come on. Oh, it's all here. What the hell are you doing, Arlene? Get out! Oh, how did? Oh, why? I'm People are watching, for God's sake. I have to go check on the other children. There's been a rash of shoelaces being tied together. This is a dangerous world. Guys, stop still. I'm so glad the doctor was able to help you. I love you, Mommy. I love you too, honey. It's, it's, it's the Johnson siblings. Oh, they those get, kids. They got it. Yeah, they got it. They have a side hustle. Well, I hear the mother side does too. No one should know that kind of language when you're an elementary kid. <laughs> side hustle. I need more money in my Venmo account. What <laughs> Venmo account? I didn't give you a Venmo account. I did. I gave you twenty dollars. I know. Day. I what? went through that in one week. How? Well, How? why did you ask him? How did you go through twenty dollars in one week? I, Your lunch is free. I'd be late on purpose, and then I get punished. And what kind I... of thing is that? You get punished for being late. I will talk to the teacher about that. Okay, but I recommend if you 
go to the teacher. You be late. <laughs> <laughs> be late? Why would I be late? What kind of crap is that? That's the payoff, Pops. Ow. Oh, dear. Oh, my God. I'm going to get to the bottom of this. Well, I'm going to. I'm going with you to get to the bottom of this. Those Johnsons, they're just... This is horrible. You know what? Can uh, we go to Applebee's for dinner? Yeah, we can. <laughs> we, we can. Crap, but okay. And whatever you want, honey. I want Applebee's and twenty more dollars in my Venmo. Uh, okay. Yeah, I'll stop. I'll stop. stop giving him all kinds of money. Shouldn't we be discharged first before he walks away? <laughs> I don't know. This Eddie? is like not. Oh, well, Myers is in charge, so yeah, this is what happened. At HR. Uh, 4 p.m. at HR. 4 p.m. Thursday in front of the board. Take your seats. You're here in front of the board. We have a really big board. That's <laughs> like a lot of 42 yep I, I keep track of everything on the uh, and we appreciate that Ms. Johnson we appreciate that very much but now you're to tell the board why HR called you here and how that does not fit into our corporate policy explain uh, yourself oh well I've been mingling my personal life with my uh, with my work life and uh, you're not supposed to do that and I've been taking advantage of subordinates. And I've uh, been punishing them sometimes when they're out of line, when they're being late specifically, because it really pisses me off, because people shouldn't be late. What would HR say? Well. Oh, no, you don't have to answer. That's our job, <laughs> not yours. I'll accept whatever my consequences are because every action has a consequence. And I was out of line. But I did it in good intentions. I, uh, I really meant well. Um, there are times that, you know, sometimes when people go through tragedies or horrible, horrible situations in life, they just... We don't care about tragedies. We don't care about your tragedies. We only care about the business. Now, That's it's right. time to bring down our judgment of punishment. Okay. You will be sentenced to attending every seminar on defined pension versus defined benefit plans. <laughs> no! You Please. will have to proofread all of the no. health insurance no. No. applications. No. And the annual reviews of every person in the department, you will list all their pluses and minuses, ah. what they've done, what they hope to do, and why they haven't done what they said they were going to do. Later that night at Rick's place. <laughs> yeah, sorry I let the whole Jessica animatronic thing slip. You know, that was really not a key. No, it's good. I got rid of the whole thing. I got rid of the picture. You know, she heard Applebee's when I was with you? Yeah, yeah. That really opened my eyes. Yeah, so you're ready to move on, right? Yeah. yeah. Fuck yourself up. I mean, Just, wow, did she really controlled me, didn't she? I was a sniveling little wimp. Yeah, you were really just a pure. Not wow. even totally human. I mean, you couldn't even choose what water you wanted to. At 7 Eleven, she had it wrapped around her little finger like that. Yeah, it's because if you brought home the wrong. It doesn't matter why. I'm... You need somebody who. who understands you for who you are, Rick. Yeah, but. I don't know if there's anybody like that. No, no, no. Somebody who, who, who cares for you. You know? <laughs> if only there was someone. Like, man, if there was just someone just like. Right? Oh, that would be great. Someone who, when they see you, 
It brings out a better part of themselves. Gosh, that'd be awesome. Yeah, yeah, somebody who, who knows you, who might be a little afraid to tell you how he feels. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, but, but she would tell me then, and, and then the moment we like locked eyes, we'd have an instant connection, you know, we would... <laughs> <laughs> Is this happening? I think it's happening. I don't understand it, Rick. I don't, I don't either. It just came upon me like a freight train. You've been here the entire time. You've been here. It's, it's like you've been like two ships missing in the. In the it's well, Goodwin, we, we it's Goodwin, Goodwin, Goodwin. No, it's actually Goodwin ships miss. So it must be some <laughs> other metaphor. Okay, it's like two planes crashing into each no, other. No, or no, like, no, 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 no. That would be awesome. Just learn to see. Dan? Yeah. I don't ever want to forget this moment. Okay. I'm gonna take your picture right now. <laughs> just so I'll always remember you just like this. <laughs> Smile. <laughs> Hand down. <laughs> children. Human resources does not impede in personal homes of employees. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, that's good to know because I, I couldn't see that. <laughs> remember, remember, I told you I had. Is, is, is he going to be my father? I remember him. He was I, here. Oh, hi. Last week. Hi. Really You're going to be my father. What? Well, I don't think we're there yet. I mean, I just, uh, uh, oh, my God. I need a father. I know you're really. He needed. really needs a father. He watches too much RuPaul. <laughs> this is my my son. Uh, I figured. Yeah, my my son, oh, Ron, Ronnie. Ronnie, it's good to yeah. meet you. I'm I'm Louie. We haven't formally met yet. I, I'm Louie. Really, I, I know you don't. I, I want to make that up to you. And um, this is Bob. Yeah. He's, he's gonna join us for for dinner. For dinner. Hi, Bob. Hi, Bob. Yeah, yeah. I'm so glad you were on time. Do you have so nice. have children, Bob? I I don't have children. No. Great! But again, I think you're reaching a little into, I mean, you're just... Uh, We're getting to know each other a lot better in a, in a, in a normal capacity. Yeah. Yeah, so, so uh, why don't uh, 
You know, I'll, uh, I'll sit down and why don't we get to know each other? Mom made us sure. Watson's Hungry Men for all of us. And as they settled down for a good early dinner, we fast forward six months later at Rick's house. Congratulations. Congratulations, Bob. Really, I mean, I'm honored to be your best man. This would be great. It sounds like things are really working out for Sheila. Dude. I wouldn't have anybody. I hope one day I find the happiness you do. I, I, I wish that for you. I thought I had it with Dan. Yeah. I, I thought that was, you know, a coming out so. kind of thing. I, I thought that you would, uh, it was, uh, okay. I thought we moved past a certain. Uh, kind we of did move past it. To uh -huh. prove it, I've got something surprise for you. Oh, that's great. Check this out. Make Rick happy. <laughs> uh, Always make Rick happy. I don't know that that. I, I know Dan. He wouldn't make say Rick that. Happy. I mean, it's, it's like. No, no the, the improved Dan would. <laughs> Rick, you can't just improve people. They are what they are. I am what I am. I know, and look how you became happy. Well, that was different. I, I changed. I evolved. And I changed and evolved, and Dan has evolved. <laughs> Doll. Okay, Dan is a three-dimensional hologram. Okay, for God's sake! What is so hard to get about that? Everybody says that. Hi, Dan. I was wrong. Rick was right. Oh, come on! <laughs> Dan didn't do that. He was always had his own opinions. He was very forceful about his opinions. He was a pain in the ass about his opinions. Maybe. Dan, would you like to watch Forge and Fire? Yes. I'd like to watch whatever you want to watch, Rick. Oh, I see you programmed that whole thing out of the Jessica doll, too. I think you, you just didn't even allow for that anymore. I'm happy now. And like you're happy. No, not like well, I'm happy. Rick, this, this can't go on. Sure, kid. You've got two lovely... Soon to be stepchildren, do not deny Rick. <laughs> a wonderful fiance. Well, I'm not, I know, it's great. It's great. I, I am very, very happy. I, I, are you really, really happy? I, I am, but don't block Dan's view. <laughs> uh, okay. He likes to watch my show, so don't obstruct. Yeah, I think I finally am happy. Well, maybe I'll, I'll just sit down. Again, I, I, if you're happy, I'm happy for you, Rick. Yeah, I mean, absolutely I am. Who am I to and, judge? And that's, with this, that's just weird. I've got the old Jessica remote. <laughs> Wonder what would happen if I pressed that right now. Who would know? Yeah, let's find out. I think that's a good idea. <laughs> I mean, I'm pretty sure something will happen. <laughs> There's a... You suck, Rick. <laughs> You're horrible. Oh, hey. Well, don't, deny it, I, uh... don't deny Rick. Don't deny Rick. Don't deny Rick. Dan, this is, is Jessica. Or is it for real? Jessica, this is Dan. You tried to get rid of me? You pushed me in the cabinet? Well, I crawled out. I can turn you off again, Jessica. You can't turn me off. I, you can. I admire your neural net. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think it syncs with my... Neural net structure perfectly. Do you like Real Housewives? I. Yes, I like anything real. <laughs> Do you like Quinn Neal? Yes. And we don't have to communicate at this slow human pace. We can communicate at the speed of light. Do you want to go get some coffee or something? Sure. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so long, humanoid. Bye, Rick.
So at least things have worked out for you. And you look happy. I, I, we I, should I, maybe I capture a picture of this moment. I really don't want that. <laughs> Plus, no, I, 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 Plus, not, no pictures. Oh, God, no, I don't want to be that. <laughs> Congratulations on your marriage. Thank you. Why don't you come over for dinner sometime? Soon. Thanks, can I bring someone? Please, anyone. <laughs> I think you'll really like him. You two will have a lot in common. <laughs> Thank you.